Okay, so in this video, I want to show you how to pan and zoom using Filmora X, Filmora 9, or Filmora Pro 10. So this is how you pan and zoom your videos in Filmora. Let's get into my desktop here and see how to pan and zoom with Filmora. All right, so we are here on Filmora Pro, Filmora X or 10, whatever Filmora you're using. This is how you pan and zoom using Filmora. So I want to pan and zoom. Now the first thing you want to do is you want to look for a, a section that is going to pan and zoom. So I have selected this section here that I wanted to pan and zoom. So the first thing I want to do, I want to highlight that section and then I want to navigate my cursor to this point here. You see this point here, which is written crop. So go to crop. Once you highlight this section, go to crop, click on crop, and then you are brought to this window. So here on this window, we have the first one here is crop. The next one here is pan and zoom. So I want to pan and zoom, not crop per se. So you go to pan and zoom there. And here it is, guys. So here we are. So if you look at this, we have two uh, boxes here or two rectangles or squares, the way it appears on your side. The first one is written start, the next one is written end. So end is how the last section is going to be. Start is, of course, it's going to start. So panel and zoom is like it is going to move yourself this particular image here or video here towards some end and then it is going to stop. Let's see how it works. So once you're here, uh, you can highlight start here. It's start is highlighted or you can highlight end here. So start is where the pan is going to start and then end is where the pan is going to end. All right, so if I highlight on start, uh, maybe I, I don't want it to start there. I want it to start, say somewhere, somewhere here. So I'm just going to do this somewhere there and then maybe I want it to so once I've done that then maybe I want it to end so I have to highlight end there so I want it to end maybe somewhere okay let me just do that again again it's just the way you want it to go so then we're going to see how this is going to go so I wanted to start on this big box here then I wanted to end on this one so then once you've done that then just click uh, OK. So let's see how that goes. All right, so let's play this and see. So let's look at that and see how it goes. So let's, let me play that. You see that, you've seen the way it is moving that video in, like I'm still talking, but the video is panning towards some end there. Then once it reaches this end, let's say you wanted the next part of the video to continue with your image at that particular end section. Now that one just needs you to play around with uh, pan and zoom. So I want my video to continue with me, with this picture on this end of the video. It's so simple. Now from here, from this next section here, let's come back to my timeline here. From this next section here, I want to continue with this uh, kind of uh, illustration here. So firstly, what you want to do is you want to come here and then click on again that pan and zoom and then you want to take these uh, numbers here, the ratio here. So it's 1453 by 817. You might want to write that somewhere. So once you get those numbers, then now you want, you want this last part to continue in this other next proceeding or continuing video. So I'm going to highlight this next part of my video. And then I come again to crop there. And then I'm going to make sure I have those. Uh, remember those numbers? I want to have them there. So if my mind was 1453 uh, by by 817 like that so it is going to be 817 and then i want to make sure where was i i was somewhere there like that so it's something like that so uh, of course just play around with this thing until a point which you think you wanted it to be like that so let's see let's see if that is going to happen the way we want it to go You see that it has stopped where I want it to stop and then it continues with that person speaking on the video from that particular point going forward. So it's just about playing in and around with pan and zoom until you get what you want, okay? So I hope you liked that video and please don't forget to subscribe and give us a comment. It really helps us. It gives us some motivation to continue producing more videos for you.